the previous episode we acquired the transmutation table which lets us access parallel universes in order to partake in the interdimensional free market which lets us exchange goods for other goods of the same theoretical value. And since the realm I currently reside in is a third world shithole I was able to exploit the local proletariat and amass humongous wealth. It's what they call buy low sell high in the finance circles. Holy shit I turned Minecraft into a stock market simulator. I can make the full armor since it's free basic. Wouldn't hurt to get dripped out a little bit. Okay, where is my business partner? Hold on. Someone said I can use space. Oh, okay. Fuck champ. Let's go. Melons would be the best. Free for an entire emerald. I could pump out the items quicker. Do we have melons? We don't have melons. That's terrible. Why does he not sell melons? This would be good. A tablet. Like a handheld version. Can I use undesign? I can. Epic. I really should build the cage for him. No! Go back. Okay. F no, no, no. Oh my god. Uh, that works for me. Okay. I need the melons. I think I will embark on a journey to get melons. Melons spawn in jungles. So can I find a list of like all available trades in the entire game? And then I will make the appropriate block to turn a, a default villager into one of these. Okay, I, I found it. I think. Do compasses stack? I'm sorry for the creative, but they do stack. Okay. This is coming from a cartographer. And how do I make a cartographer? What block? Minecraft. How to make a cartographer? Blah blah blah, underwater, blah blah blah. Cartographer's table. How do I make that shit? Okay, two paper and wood. Do I have paper? Do I have paper? I don't. Sugar cane? I do. Great. Let's, let's go. Now. Oh, guys. Come, please. Learn! See, look, learn. Learn. Yes! Okay, now we have to have to unlock the traits. Yeah, there we go. Fuck. Okay, uh, get rid of this. I'm gonna have to craft a compass first though. Redstone and four iron ingots. I have all of that. I knew the redstone would come in handy. I knew I should mine it. Pokchamp. Crafting table. This. Okay, pick. Learn. Where is the guy? No, not you. Where's my cartographer? He was here a second ago. For fuck's sake. Run, run away. He ran away. He does not want to do business with me. Where is he? Here. Okay. No, okay, look. Look. Come back, motherfucker. Okay. Look! <laughs> no, the lags! The XP! I should install the mod. I should install the mod that uh, clumps XP. Fuck. Yeah, pure dolly. Okay, we wait, I guess. I'm, I'm enjoying the slideshow, guys. Uh, are you enjoying it as much as I do? It's a sight to behold. Uh, particles. Off, please. Can I do off? No! Cannot! <laughs> what is this? I have to save and quit and restart the game with the mod installed. Imagine the world crashes and becomes unusable. Now we sell it all. Okay. Printing it. Printing that shit. 26 million already. Where is the guy? Come here. This is his house, yes? No sleeping. You have to trade with me now. Yeah, the XP sound effect. Holy fuck. I shoot min max and install mouse tweaks so that I can just them inside if the compatibility even is there which i'm sure it is there but yeah ah. the first step in the mod is this but we need one of each item we are transmuting which means we will go we will need to go to the nether uh, get one netherite and kill wither once but that will come later this is the most boring part of the process once we get to the fucking chunk duping or i don't know how to dupe in minecraft i'm sorry but, but we will do we will duplicate and it will be epic. I never thought I would be butterfly clicking fucking villager traits, but here we are. You know what they say, li life is full of surprises, right? I'm feeling like I'm playing a clicker game and I, and I just broke it, you know? You stay here and I'm out. I should make an enchanting table and drip myself out completely. So... Whatever, let's do. Let's go with that for now. But I need the efficiency on a pickaxe. Uh, I, I need, I need... Ooh! I, I, I mean, I, I'm happy that I got fortune. Meanwhile, it does literally nothing because of the table. And in case I die, I should make a transmutation table and like put it somewhere anyway, so that I can pull out a, a, another one of these or something. Wait, so yeah. I think we should go to the Nether now and find some. Uh, how was it called? Nether, right? Yes. Okay. Almost. Are the beds even that good, actually? Because I like I can mine faster, right? Oh. <gasps> okay. The, the bets turned out to be epic. Hello. On the go. 
Wait. It does not have EMC. We have to turn it. Okay. Going back to base. And I did go back to base and then back to the nether to get some skeleton heads. And then electricity went out and I was using an old OBS version without the safe MP4. And the replay mod file is also corrupted, so yeah, half an hour of footage lost. Villagers can go to sleep before I can. Crazy. Not that much quality footage was lost though, actually. I just literally got three heads with a looting free sword, which took some time actually. It's crazy. There was a mod that made the skeletons drop shards and you could create the skulls from the shards to alleviate some of the RNG pain, but uh, Mojang cannot implement that in the base game. Of course, it's impossible. The technology is simply not there yet. Anyway, let's 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 go. Let's go. Let's kill the motherfucker. Uh, where would be a good spot? In the nether probably. On the roof. Uh, actually, let's do that. I feel like because of the power outage, my inventory reverted a bit. This was enchanted. Can you like somehow block him? <sighs> Why? How does it work, guys? Why? Okay, my fear is that, that there has to be space around him. Okay, it worked. How annoying is the block breaking? Come here. Okay. He's stuck, I think. Box jump. Okay, epic. The star. We're learning it instantly. Box digging jump. to the nether portal, best strategy ever. Hey, okay. half a heart of damage. Insane. Lava sure is scary. Nether stars, block of netherite, and the block of diamond makes infinity crystal without a space bar in between. Let's make uh, some blocks. Okay. Block of netherite, diamonds, nether stars, and boom. First one. Box jump. We can learn it. Okay, what's the next step? Turning it into blocks is the next step. Now we use block of netherite and this infinity crystal block without space bars and create chaos ingots. And with this, uh, we can create block of chaos. <gasps> it's problematic though. This has... This is... 140 million EMC for just one ingot. That's half... More than half of what we have. The block is 1 billion and... 300 million. We need 9 of these blocks to make one chaos chunk. And we need the chaos chunks, 9 of them, to create a chaos chunk block. That's a bit insane. Just a tiny little bit. One could say it's slightly unreasonable. This is the first weapon, actually. Chaotic sword. 26 billion EMC. I'm sure we're gonna achieve that soon. At this point, the best thing to do would be duplicating our inventory somehow with this in it. I'm gonna make just enough EMC for a second one to make it quicker because we're almost there. Where is my... It's not this guy. Here? Yep, here. Okay. Alright. Okay. Two chaos ingots in my inventory. We need to duplicate it. But I'm not sure how. I guess I'm gonna go on an adventure to research the possibilities. 1.16.5 Inventory Duplication Glitch. Some barrel dupe is showing. He says you have to place it down and save the game. And now we rejoin the world. Put the items in. And now I go to fuck the fucking uh, task manager and end the task. So I'm launching the game back and the items should now be both in my inventory and in the chest. We will see about that. But if it does work, we're just gonna grow stronger exponentially. Pokchan. Okay, the moment of truth. It does not work. <sighs> Someone is saying in the comments that if the game lags, it's better. I, I, I repeated all the steps, now I'm launching the game back. Please, 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 please. Okay, I have them in my inventory. <laughs> okay. Okay, box jump. Box jump. Box jump. Uh, the recording might be a slideshow though, even worse than in the game. Let's do it one more time. Where is my Java process? Right, uh, right here. And task. Relaunch the game. Okay. The last time. I can full screen it now. There you go. Borderless Minecraft. Epic. Why is it not a base feature? I don't understand. Now then, uh, let's pump it into our transmutation table. 38 billion. Okay, we need blocks of chaos. So, like this. Can learn them. And another right sword. Okay. That's it. That's it. Okay. Box jump. We can learn it. Look, look, look. <laughs> Instant death. Oh, so sorry. I, my, my reaction to the, the to crafting the sword was wrong. Okay. <clears throat> let me... Let me do another try. Box jump!
Okay, that's that was better, I think. So if we are here, what is the next step? Is it yes, the 60 <sighs> I don't even know what what number that is. No, not this. This. I think. Yes, yeah. The extended one. Chaos chunk blocks and chaotic and, and three chaotic swords. This will be something we do in the next episode. And subscribe to the channel and like the video. Do it or else I shove this up your ass 